Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Magandang umaga, magandang hali, magandang gabi sa inyo lahat. Ngayong good start, ngayong good to, ngayong gabi sa inyo lahat. Uh, kung saan mga kayo sa sulok ng mundo, sana yun nasa mabuti kayong kalagayan. I'm here right now preparing to run. And before run, we're gonna um, do some... Lifting weight a little bit. Ano tayo? Um, routine every Saturday. Ginagawa natin to. Tatakbo tayo twice, twice a week. Uh, twice a week. And then, um, bago tayo tumakbo, kailangan nakaluto na sa ang pagkain na breakfast. Sa ating family. Okay? So, since I'm going to run outside day of natin ngayon <coughs> kailangan may wallet may paper spray may susi at saka ng kusin ng kotse just in case pupunta ka ng kotse at sa jacket sa kumalo hindi, tripod to at saka importante may sa lahat Ah, uh, mayroon tayong privilege to bring dito ito extra. Extra magazine. Pinagalog tayo ng ating <coughs> um, give us a privilege to have a uh, permit to carry in our beloved ship here in in our oh Langoy na. Ulit. So, yeah, uh, this is the routine. And kailangan natin mag-exercise ng konti. Nag-stretch na ako kanina. Ano ko lang to? Uh, ito tapos na. So, yeah, dahil alis, alis tayo, <clears throat> so when we go outside make sure that you protect yourself and this is uh, my, my concealed carry um, this in a holster but make sure that it's not it's not a uh, cop but when you go there make sure to unlock have a manual safe make sure the manual safe is off and don't put, don't put um, ammo in the chamber because when you go out there, your level of awareness for safety tip is make sure that 100% or 110%, 101%, the high, the high level of awareness, okay? Because if, if something out there uh, suspicious you already know just stay away of that suspicious and if some if they follow you then then you uh, strategy start you make a strategy strategize your movement or just stop and um, prepare your phone or oh, but by the way you need to bring your phone with you. Kailangan mong dalhin yung phone mo. Okay? And make sure that it's full charge. Alright? I don't wanna show you. It's, it's holstered. So I, and use the belt that it fit here. It click by the belt that it fit. This belt, I'm gonna show you. Uh, allow me to speak in English. Most half of my subscribers is English speaking. I, I guarantee that uh, uh, to those um, <clears throat> um, to those my subscribers that not from here, I I I, I, I mean, I have the confidence that the, you guys uh, understood understand understand my English carabao. So this bullet belt I buy from some uh, company. I don't wanna disclose the company for now, but I buy this for 
um, for this uh, purpose. Look. It's not enough. It's it's really tight. So <clears throat> where it is? Here in our, our place is safe. We have. Uh, okay. Uh oh, we have a gate, and then of course we are just gonna run up inside in the community. So we here and uh, click that, and we're gonna wear a jacket after this. We're gonna do this before work, after work, but run, I have to run three miles or one and a half mile, three miles back and forth, two times a week. Okay, so that's it for now. I read it earlier. And then, if you want, <clears throat> where the jogging, jogging pants that? Oh, by the way, forgot to tell you, just, just in case, you go out there, <clears throat> make sure you wear, you wear your Bluetooth. Because when you call something, just in case, you're not gonna hold your phone like that. Make sure your two hands is free. After you dial, dial 911 or <clears throat> someone, put your phone in the pocket while your headphone on and while talking and your phone, your two hands is free, okay? That's a security tip. So, <clears throat> make sure you wear the, the jogging pants has a, a zip, zipper to put your um, wallet in the back. All right? And this this extra magazine, you always bring the extra magazine, magazine put in here in the back as a clip also because my privilege is concealed need to be to hide that paper spray of course you're gonna use this first something like if someone attack you without firearm with them if they try to attack you and of course first Verbal communication, very important. Never, never use this without um, reason, okay? You need to um, have that um, reasonable, uh, you have that uh, really reason why you're gonna use this like for example you already um delivered the the verbal communication like stop back up back up and and you saw you saw them they try to punch you then you're gonna use this okay but if knife <clears throat> it's different story okay that's the happen that's the time that you're gonna use your firearm but oh, this firearm is is really far far away uh um it's not it, you're not gonna use that not until the bad guy in front of you i mean the bad guy towards you has a a firearm gun okay i'm gonna go now so Let's go. <clears throat> so.
So let's go. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Let's go run. Just run and walk, run, jog and walk, okay? It's really hot. Now, we're gonna do the exercise here. Here is cold this time. Mga big papo. Siguro mga ten o'clock in the morning. Here it is. Do the stretching. Earlier, for continuation, continuation for the secure tip, sinabi ko kanina, <clears throat> yeah, kaya, well, that's why I don't put the armor in the chamber because I have uh, <clears throat> time to rock just in case to protect myself. All right? Because again, as I said earlier, I have to have a, le a high level of <clears throat> awareness, okay? <clears throat> Again, to secure yourself, to protect yourself, and to be aware of your surrounding is not paranoia. Okay, hindi paranoia. <clears throat> just in case some someone come towards you like 15 feet away or 20 feet away you have that uh, kind of uh, evaluation what is his uh, face reaction or hands movement in the shoulder? All right, that's for 
very important for everyday living. You have to have that kind of level of awareness, kind of uh, um, evaluation, to identify that uh, individual, okay? So, kailangan natin mag, magmasid. And then, if you run or your friend with you go hiking and walk, uh, hiking or run, you have to inform that you obligate to inform that friend that you have you you have privilege to carry concealed. Okay, you have to info, obligate to inform that friend, inform that um, you know. But your family already know. But in, just in case you go with your friend, right, to protect you and just to re remind you if you are here in. In my area, or anywhere in the in the state, I believe you obligate to protect the third party. All right, but here I'm sure that you obligate to protect yourself, including the third party, your family and the third party. Third party is your friend. Okay, because just in case. Just in case, God forbid, something happened, and then your friend, something happened to your friend, and you don't do anything to protect him or her, the, um, law enforcement, you get in trouble with, with the law enforcement. They're gonna question you and you have a lot of um, you know question or uh, explanation you're gonna give to law enforcement okay make sure that the reason is I mean valid Kung mag, mayroon mga kasama, kailangan sa Pilipinas, kailangan ka talaga mag, ang ano ko, ang ano ko lang, uh, alam natin na sa Pilipinas, yung mga may, halimbawa may mga gun ban doon dahil sa may election, ang ano ko lang doon, ang comment ko lang doon parang, uh, hindi hindi ako sang ayo na yung ganban dahil pag ganban mo paano yung kalahan niya protektahan di ba tatakbo ng kapitan tatakbo takbo ng anumang position when you go to his his uh, present or station kung saan siya magboboto paano niya paano niya protektahan yung sarili niya kung hindi siya pwede magdala ng kanyang um um privilege to protect herself kasi bago yung magkaroon ng firearm mayroon niyang ano, training mayroon niyang uh, neuro or test or drug test para magkaroon sila ng firearm to protect themselves Be, being a responsible gun owner 
How can you protect yourself? Kung ikaw mismo legit ka na nagkakaroon ng privilege to protect yourself, hindi bang protektahan sa sarili mo? Pag, uh, ba, may restriction, dahil gun, ano, gun ban, kung tuloy talaga nila gun ban, di yung uh, mga gun owner, um, responsible gun owner, exempted na yun. Basta may pakita lang sila na na license. Alright? So, very important, be aware of your surrounding, okay? But again, the escalation and avoid that two words is very important. Alright? Hindi porke meron kang gamit, meron kang privilege, sabi lang mo, meron kang privilege to protect yourself, meron kang ganyan, gamit, and kalimutan mo na yung training nyo. Kung meron kayong training, yung neuro, ah, uh, neuro, I mean, oh yeah, neuro test. Kalimutan nyo yung mga tanong doon. <clears throat> so So, kumusta? Kumusta na ka dyan? Sana'y nasa pagbuti kang kalagayan. Inhale, exhale, inhale. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Jag lang po ito, jag. Yan. 
Ginagawa natin to three times or two times a week. We try to do three times a week. Ilit na dapat kailangan maaga pa dito. Ito. Okay. Maaga pa dito, yung wala pang palang init. Tanghali na tayo natulog kagabi. Ah, tanghali. Gabi na natulog. Kaya tanghali na gumising. Kabaliktad, baliktad na. Yan ang hirap na. Buhol, buhol mga Tagalog na. Walk jack, walk jack. So may tanong ako sa inyo. Mahalis ba ang buhol sa bansang Pilipinas? Dahil sa kalagayan ng ating Pilipinas? I mean, mahalis ba ang buhol? Tanong nato ng kaibigan natin. Tanong, tanong natin dito ulit. Mahalis ba ang buhol? sa ating kalagayan ng kalagayan ng Pilipinas. Okay? Kung sino makakasagot diyan, comment kayo diyan. Ah. Uh, eh sulat kayo pangalan mo kung sino makasagot diyan. At sa para natin, meron kang extra reward. All right? Remind mo ako. Pero isulat ko 'yan. Okay? Malis ba ang buhol? sa kalagayan ng ating Pilipinas alright ok kung hindi oo may explanation alright ok bye bye for now